today we are most possibly gonna see sunfishes, lots of dolphins, maybe sharks. Is that your your dive? Our next voyage took us to a little town called Tosa de Mar, a beautifully preserved medieval town on the northwest coast of Spain. Sweetness. Best it's, view ever. Yeah, but it's still weird to like just leave her out there and. Uh, Over there and here. We have everybody filming, taking pictures. So we're in the medieval town of um, Villa Vella. Villa Vella. I don't know if I pronounce it right, but it is just beautiful. Everything is. I don't know if it's restored. I think it's being. It's, it was built up again. It's just beautiful, like cobblestone streets and I'm not sure if people are living here still but it kind of looks like that not, not sure though Dosa de Mar is a medieval town approximately seven nautical miles north of Blanes the port we bunkered down for a week of mistrial it is surrounded by pine trees and was built into cliffs right at the sea there is evidence of settlement dating back to the Neolithic period, which was about 7,000 years ago. Sometime in the 12th century, the medieval town was walled off and a castle was built on the highest point of Mount Guardi. All of this is so beautifully done. This is really, really nice. So we just uh, came down from the lighthouse up there. And now we're in a half intact uh, church. Beautiful, check it out. Absolutely gorgeous. Smells a little like piss. <laughs> She's speechless, he's speechless, oh my goodness, he's no, it's, speechless. It's really nice, I'm very happy we came here. I said it several times already, but I'm very happy we stopped here. I think you're fishing for compliments. Why? Because it was your idea to come here. Oh, yeah. And baby, it's, it's perfect. <laughs> you did a good job. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking forward, actually I'm looking forward to go further up north and see more of these colors yes, everywhere. It's really yeah, cool. Absolutely, okay. We helped out a local fisherman with giving him a ride back to his boat. As mentioned, we were expecting a mistral that was about to blow for a straight five days. Those winds can last from two up to six days and are super cold and can reach wind speeds of well over 75 knots. That gave us the opportunity to explore Blanes and its surroundings. We are off to Lloret, Lloret de Mar. Lloret. No, she said Lloret. Really? Yeah. She has no idea what okay. she's talking yeah, about. Yeah, she's from here, but she doesn't know. 
Okay, we're off to Loret de Mar. It's uh, where young Swiss girls and boys are going to meet their their uh, first summer love. No, I say <laughs> to get drunk. Okay, so this is where we go drinking. Instead of drinking, we found ourselves some test merch. So keep an eye out for these hats. Okay, and we drank as well. We went to Loret de Mar this morning to say bye to Gabriela. She took the bus to Barcelona and we went to the shop to get our new sailing coral hats. And then decided to walk all the way back to Blanes. I'm pretty sure you can't really see how steep it is, but it's... <coughs> it's steep. I tried to film it, but it's, it's pretty close. <laughs> Filming my ass. Okay. It's a good thing the view is so nice that we can take a break every now and then. The hike back to Blanes took us about four hours and change. It is a beautiful hike and it takes you along the coastline on a very well maintained hiking path. Good morning and happy Easter everybody! So yeah, it's Easter weekend and we decided to have ourselves some little brunch, no decoration. Do you like my decoration? Couldn't find any, and uh, but free flow mimosas and coffee and salmon toast. What's the rush, babe? The rush is because we're late. We, we got up early, but we are still late. <laughs> and we're going to um, the bus station to drive to Gerona or something like that um, to pick up a car. Because of the nasty weather, we decided to stay in Blanes or around Blanes for one more week. But we definitely need a car to not get bored to be able to buy so a lot of groceries and um, do some laundry. And the next laundromat is like 25 minutes by foot and we have so much dirty laundry to do, so you know, it's easier and better to get a car. We arrived in Girona by bus. The weather is not really playing along for sailing, so uh, we thought we'd rent the car and do some uh, Day trips. Worry about your head. But you do fear being left alone. You may double your guards. This is what happens when you don't do laundry for two weeks. And have guests. And have guests. Yeah. And there's more stuff laying around down below so this is today's mission we're going uh, to find a laundry since we have a rental car for a breathtaking six euros a day we're gonna find a laundry and do some laundry and clean up and get Cora ready to uh, get out there again because the weather is changing to the better I was always by your side It's time to set it straight No more talk about your fast life Hey everyone! Hi guys! We thought we are gonna shoot you uh, our first real-time message. We're in Camp de Mar, in a beautiful little bay. Um, Koro is anchored right behind us. And uh, yeah, we thought we uh, were gonna say hello from the present. We arrived on Mallorca almost four weeks ago and um, time's running so fast. We were looking um, forward to this um, first night sail, the long passage. It took us about 21 hours, I think. We left the coast of Spain in the afternoon and sailed all night and it was perfect. 
Yeah. It was so, so cool. It's so special to sail at night. And we had like dolphins and we saw glowing jellies. So that was perfect. Everything. And a beautiful moon. And a beautiful moon because it was like a full moon the night before we left. So yeah, it was fantastic. Yeah, so the reason for this message is um, to tell you guys, well, it's obvious that we're a little bit behind with our videos. Um, it's been it's been a, a few absolutely great months, but as you can imagine, we have a lot of friends since we are from Switzerland in Europe. Um, we have a lot of friends that come visit us and family has been visiting us. So we have been slacking a little bit on the video editing. Um, we are we are trying to shoot for for a weekly schedule, releasing schedule, but um, the videos are gonna be a little bit shorter probably, which uh, doesn't make them less fun. Every now and then we try to sneak in a, a little real-time message for you guys so you know where we are at the moment. Yeah, that's right. And it's not going to stop because we will have family and more friends coming. Like, Coro is going to be packed till end of July. <laughs> I mean, it's it's not a bad thing. We're no. really looking forward to this, but we just discovered it's a lot of work to do. And, oh, yeah. you know, with, and you want to entertain your guests and everything. So, yeah, um, forgive us for that, please. <laughs> What you can do in the meantime, you can always check out my blog on uh, sailingkoru.com. This is the most up-to-date source where you can check out what we've been doing and um, where we're at right now. Uh, it comes out weekly with a um, head start for our patrons. Uh, so you can check this out every Friday and then Sunday it's going to be for everybody available on the um, the blog exactly that brings us to our next topic patrons patreon because we uh, we have decided to start um, a patreon page and for those of you who don't know what patreon is it's a it's a platform for artists where they can make a dime on the side um, all of this camera equipment and, and the time you're investing in everything is it costs money in the end and um, it's just a very, very, very honest way of supporting your favorite artist or creator. So um, head over there and check it out. It's a really, really good thing and it would help us out a lot uh, to keep on creating these, these videos for you guys and the blogs and the logs and, and go from place to place. So um, we would really appreciate if you consider becoming a part of the Koru family. Yeah, and if you have any question, if something is um, unfamiliar or unclear um, to you, please just ask. You can reach us via a Messenger on Facebook or Instagram or over the blog. You can always comment on the blogs anyway, so please just um, let us know and we will help as much as we can. Because we would really appreciate your help so we can do this what we love what we cannot imagine doing anything else right now and um, it would help us a lot and also what's really cool uh, with patreon is that you can there's like a, a messenger and a chat platform so you can we can communicate within the family we can communicate a little bit more on a personal level which I really really like to I, I, you know we're always interested in your opinions and uh, what do you like what you dislike in their videos are they too long too short too bright too whatever you know we just we just love to hear your comments on our videos and um, yeah yeah and there will also be like um, stuff you can find on YouTube like um, behind the scene uh, like short episodes we only gonna create for the patrons exactly and yeah all the goodies all the goodies <laughs> we're gonna come up with some goodies yeah. we already have some some uh, some some nice little things like hats or a t-shirt or stickers or whatever so um, yeah there is there is something in it for you as well of course and for those who already joined our tribe, thank you so much for your support. We really, really appreciate it. Yeah, we really do. We really do. Without you, this wouldn't be possible. We hope that our family grows 
very very quickly we we uh we really looking forward to do all of this with you guys together so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe that's very important um, share it with a friend of yours that you think might like the content we're producing and uh, comment let us know what you think so again thank you very very much for sticking around thank you so much guys see you, see out, you out there, there. See, see you out, out there, there. <laughs> so again thank you very much guys for sticking around yeah. okay. so we've got <laughs> You're so is that your anyway. word? Yeah, that's mine because you, you didn't say it, so did you, I said it. Did you buy the yeah, word? I bought it. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you so much, guys. See, See you, you out, out there. there. It's good. <laughs>